the relationship between New York and New Jersey has never been stronger, period. The talk on stage with Governors Phil Murphy of New Jersey and Kathy Hochul of New York was about those big picture infrastructure issues, including the much talked about Gateway Tunnel. And today they announced the man who would lead the project to expand and renovate those tunnels that run under the Hudson along the Northeast Corridor. Chris Kalari is going to be the CEO of Gateway Development Corporation. It should mean the long delayed but crucial project should take big steps toward breaking ground. But not mentioned, even amidst a conversation about public transit, was congestion pricing. The plan to, within a year or two, force cars entering Manhattan south of 60th Street to pay a surcharge to fund the MTA. Murphy and most elected leaders in New Jersey are vehemently opposed. We've had some really conversations and uh, we're very much uh, approaching this together. Hochul was light on details, taking questions after the Regional Plan Association joint appearance, but promised any disagreement would not impact Gateway. They're absolutely separate issues. This is, we are still two separate states. We have different opinions on issues sometimes, and that's fine. But what you won't see is a combative approach to other issues as a result of that. Separately, she also announced subway ridership Thursday reached a new post-pandemic high with 3.5 million subway riders, though that's still 2 million fewer than before the pandemic. Hochul remains hopeful. There's a change that's happening very quickly. This summer is going to be a big difference as well. People are going to be more comfortable coming into the city, going to their jobs as the weather gets better, and you're not uh, constantly indoors. And if you're wondering, hey, where's all the money for the crumbling roads and bridges and where's all the talk about that? I am told in conversations with the Deputy Transit Secretary for the United States that billions are coming specifically to New York and New Jersey for that need. So that is work you will see ahead in the coming years as well. Live at Chelsea Piers, Henry Rossoff, PIX11 News. All right.